Rigoletto is one of Verdi's greatest masterpieces. And not only because it's revolutionary in its structure, but also because it's revolutionary in its orchestration and the way he used the orchestra and the way that he plants the motives in the very first part of the opera and it carries through all the way to the end of the opera. It was one of his favorite operas and Rigoletto was a big success in its opening. It's a timeless masterpiece that talks about the oppression of great power and how that can affect uh, the society around the power and, and the people in charge. Musically, I would say that there is an underlying force of the curse that happens throughout, but I guess in this production it's actually interesting to really notice the degeneration of the power society to really affect the lower classes. All of these themes can transfer to our everyday life. I think that's the wonderful thing for the audiences to experience. It's a piece that speaks to us very clearly. Hilda is one of my favorite roles to sing, and I love how Verdi has written the role. There are some challenges with it, of course, um, but it's, it's such an amazing piece, and it's one of my favorites. The delicate feeling of the score, the just I think Verdi really matches that to her character so much. And, you know, in that moment, it's like an exploration of passion for her because this is the first time she's fallen in love. And so it's a beautiful tapestry of just seeing someone awaken and blossom. The music is so connected to the drama. And it, with Verdi, there was not a separation. It was always very connected. So that's why I always tell people, I say, go to the opera like if it was a, a movie, because it's really stories of our time. And yes, the singers are amazing and the orchestra is amazing, all of these things, but really it's about storytelling and how we tell that story, and it's a very powerful one. <laughs>